We now have the benefit of brain drugs that are not drugs in the pharmaceutical sense, but boy, they can really get you going and change your life. Today, we will talk about NAD nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide. Nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide, commonly referred to as NAD, is a vital coenzyme found in all living cells. It plays a crucial role in various biological processes, serving as a key mediator in energy metabolism, cellular repair, and regulatory pathways. Understanding the significance of NAD involves exploring its function sources and the implications of its levels on overall health. In cellular metabolism, NAD is involved in redox reactions, carrying electrons from one reaction to another. So it is found in two forms. NAD is an oxidizing agent, accepting electrons from other molecules and becoming reduced with age. This reaction forms NADH, which can be used as a reducing agent to donate electrons. These electron transfer reactions are the main function of NAD. It is also used in other cellular processes, most notably as a substrate of enzymes in adding or removing chemical groups to or from proteins in Pons translational modifications. Because of the importance of these functions, the enzymes involved in NAD metabolism are targets for drug discovery. It's true, there are supplements for the brain that will boost your cognitive ability and your focus and you'll be more alert and more energetic. You'll feel completely different. It doesn't even seem fair, it's so great. I've got a few I really love, and today I'm gonna to share a special one with you. Molecular functions and pathways. NAD as a coenzyme. As a coenzyme, NAD participates in redox reactions crucial for energy metabolism. It accepts electrons during the breakdown of nutrients in glycolysis and the citric acid cycle, producing NADH. The transfer of these electrons is fundamental for ATP synthesis in the mitochondria. Sirtuins and cellular regulation. NAD serves as an essential cofactor for sirtuins, a family of proteins involved in regulating cellular processes. Sirtuins are NAD-dependent decetylases that modify protein structures, impacting cellular functions such as DNA repair, stress response, and metabolic regulation. DNA repair mechanisms, polyADP ribose polymerases, PARPs, utilize NAD during DNA repair processes. In response to DNA damage, PARPs catalyze the addition of polyADP ribose, chains to proteins, facilitating repair. This NAD-dependent process is crucial for maintaining genomic stability. Cellular signaling and gene expression. NAD is involved in cellular signaling pathways that influence gene expression. Modulating sirtuins and other NAD-dependent proteins can affect the activity of transcription factors, impacting the expression of genes involved in various cellular functions. Sirtuins in aging. Role in longevity. Sirtuins, activated by NAD, have been linked to the extension of lifespan in various organisms. Research in model organisms, such as yeast, worms, and mice, has demonstrated that enhancing sirtuin activity can promote longevity and delay age-related diseases. Mitochondrial function. Sirtuins play a crucial role in maintaining mitochondrial health. By regulating mitochondrial biogenesis and function, they contribute to cellular energy production and help mitigate oxidative stress, which is associated with aging. Metabolic regulation. Sirtuins are involved in metabolic pathways, influencing processes like glucose homeostasis, lipid metabolism, and insulin sensitivity. Activation of sirtuins by NAD is implicated in the protective effects against metabolic disorders associated with aging. aging. NADD and neurodegenerative diseases. Alzheimer's disease. Emerging research explores the connection between NAD levels, sirtuin activity, and neurodegenerative diseases. 
In Alzheimer's disease, there is evidence of NAD decline and impaired sirtuin function, suggesting potential therapeutic targets to mitigate cognitive decline. I definitely have some favorites, some things that really juice my brain, but today I'm going to tell you about one in particular. It's True Niagen Pro 500. I've tried quite a few, but I have to tell you, the True Niagen Pro 500 has really gotten me through some tough days. One little pill, wow, it will rock your world. I flew over 30 hours to get to Palau, the scuba diving capital of the world, and the only day that I could dive was within hours of my arrival. I had been on airplanes, I'll be honest with you, I was drinking champagne, I was kind of partying, not really sleeping, I had friends with me that also liked to scuba dive, and it was just a tough one. I got to Palau, I got to go to sleep for a while in my bed, in my hotel room, I got up, got picked up, went out to the scuba diving site, put on the suit and everything, jumped in the water, and did three tanks. And let me tell you, this is my savior that day. I did so well with True Niagen Pro. It just woke me right up. Cup of coffee or two would not have done anything compared to what this did. It made me alert. And you really do have to be very focused. You have to know what you're doing. And the diving is not easy everywhere. We did a cave dive that was so difficult that I would have never been able to find my way out. But I kept my head the whole day and I was very grateful to True Niagen. Parkinson's disease. Similar connections are being investigated in Parkinson's disease, where mitochondrial dysfunction and oxidative stress contribute to neuronal damage. Boosting NAD levels and sirtuin activity may have neuroprotective effects in such conditions. Therapeutic Strategies NAD Precursors Nicotinamide Riboside, NR, and Nicotinamide Mononucleotide, MNN, are NAD precursors that have gained attention for their potential to elevate NAD levels. These compounds are being studied for their safety and efficacy in various contexts, including age-related conditions. Sirtuin Activators Small molecules that directly activate sirtuins are under investigation as potential therapeutics. These compounds mimic the effects of increased NAD levels, promoting cellular repair and potentially impacting the aging process. Mitochondrial health interventions, strategies aimed at improving mitochondrial function, such as enhancing NAD availability, are explored for their potential in age-related diseases. Protecting mitochondrial health contributes to overall cellular resilience and longevity. Combination therapies. Considering the interconnectedness of cellular pathways, combination therapies targeting NAD levels, sirtuin activation, and other relevant pathways are being explored. This approach aims to address multiple facets of cellular health and aging simultaneously. Challenges and future directions. Bioavailability and safety. Ensuring the bioavailability and safety of NAD precursors and activators is a critical consideration. Understanding how these compounds are metabolized, potential side effects, and long-term impacts on health are important for their clinical application. Tissue-specific effects. Investigating the tissue-specific effects of NAD modulation is essential. Different tissues may respond differently to interventions, and understanding these nuances is crucial for targeted therapeutic approaches and minimizing potential side effects. Individual variability. Recognizing the variability in individuals' responses to NAD modulation is a challenge. Genetic factors, lifestyle, and overall health may influence how individuals benefit from interventions, requiring personalized approaches. Regulatory approval. NAD boosting interventions are in the early stages of clinical development. Obtaining regulatory approval for these interventions involves rigorous testing for safety, efficacy, and the demonstration of clear benefits in specific clinical conditions. Ethical considerations. Equitable access. As research progresses, 
ensuring equitable access to potential NAD, boosting interventions is essential. Addressing disparities in healthcare and making these therapies accessible to diverse populations are ethical imperatives. Informed consent. Individuals considering NAD modulation therapies should be provided with comprehensive information about potential risks, benefits, and uncertainties. Informed consent is crucial for ethical clinical practice and research. Nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide, NAD, stands at the forefront of cellular processes crucial for health and longevity. Its role in energy metabolism, DNA repair, and cellular regulation through sirtuins makes it a central player in the complex web of cellular functions. Exploring the potential therapeutic applications of NAD modulation requires a balanced understanding of its molecular intricacies, challenges in clinical translation, and ethical considerations. As research progresses, unlocking the full potential of NAD may hold the key to novel interventions that promote healthy aging and addressed age-related diseases.